excited today to show you a pen that might be one of the most unusual pens I've come across in a long time. And it's quite beautiful. And I'm talking about this pen in this box from Griffo Pens. It's a pen company where all the pens are made in Italy. Let's unbox this pen. I'm gonna take this top off and you have the Griffo Pen logo. And inside is your pen. It is highly unusual looking, right? But before I get to talking about the pen, ha, you thought I was gonna talk about it right away. <laughs> Let's look at this. It's only one piece of paperwork, so it'll go fast. It's got paperwork. It's got the Griffos logo on it. Open it up. And it tells you a little bit about this pen. And so what it is, it is a writing instrument guaranteed to be made by craftsmen, Italian craftsmen, in sterling silver and marine stingray skin. That's right. That, what you see on this pen, stingray leather. Yeah, I told you it was unusual. This pen actually comes in different colors. It comes in gray, green, blue, and this one is the red, of course. I like the red, I picked the red. This is actually on loan to me from Griffos, but I do have the option to purchase. We'll talk about that later. So the red is actually available in limited quantities. And as you can see, the trim on it is rose gold, which I think that's really nice to get. The red and rose gold looks great together. And let's see, the cap is, you know, it's a long cap. Here are the cap ring. It kind of has a bulbous shape to it. The finial is plain. The clip has a very unusual shape, which I appreciate. And then the end of the barrel has that rose gold as well. To me, the standout feature of this pen is definitely that stingray. And what you are seeing there that's reflecting light are called the bone bubbles. And what the bone bubbles are, it is from the ocean depositing minerals into the skin of the stingray. Okay, I know what you're thinking right now. You're like, you're like, you mean they just go out into the ocean and they kill these stingray for the pen? No, that's not at all how it goes down, okay? So please, just know that this leather, it is a byproduct from food production. So this is material that would be otherwise thrown away. But Griffos has utilized this stingray leather and they apply it to pens. So it actually is being reused. So this is something that would be trashed in the first place that is taken and placed onto a pen, which I think is really cool. And the cool, cool thing about this pen is the texture. It is so interesting. It's, you can feel these bubbles and it's not rough. It's actually smooth. So somehow they have it kind of polished down and I just can't get over how much it reflects light. In fact, I, the other day I, I had this pen with me at the car wash. Don't judge me. My car got dirty. It rained. I needed to get it washed, but I had this pen with me because I wanted to, I don't have it inked and I know it's weird to carry it around, but I wanted to just look at it. So in the car wash, I'm waiting to go into the car wash and I just happen to have it kind of like this in front of me and the sunlight is coming in just perfectly through the window and it's reflecting onto the steering wheel and I'm just sitting here just looking at it. So of course I got my phone out and recorded it. Check it out. Yeah, don't judge me. I mean, if you're watching this video, you're probably just as obsessed with pens as I am. And I am like completely obsessed. It is a, it's an issue. It's a problem. Yeah. Like this weekend, I totally, I cleaned about 50 or 60 pens that were inked on my desk. As you can see, my desk is actually quite clean right now. Let's look at this nib. So let me take off this cap. It does post actually. It's a friction fit post. And that's what it looks like in the hand. So I will probably not post this pen 
and you know, which is fine for me. Some of you guys might want to post it because it might be a little short for you, especially if you have bigger hands. So here's the nib. It does come with a nice large number six Bach nib. This is a stainless steel nib on this pen. And that section, that is sterling silver. Yes, it is. It is sterling silver with this beautiful galosh patterning that also reflects light. I mean, there's just a lot of eye candy happening in this pen. I mean, it's insane, right? But look, just check out how perfectly the nib and the section match. I mean, it's just seamless. I'm, I, I'm sorry about this chair I'm using right now. It's, I know it's noisy and I can hear and it's driving me kind of, it's kind of getting on my nerves. So I hope it's not getting on your nerves too bad, but <laughs> you do what you gotta do, right? I just think this looks beautiful. On the back of the section, it is stamped with a 925. And it is a cartridge converter pen and it does come with a converter. It looks like a standard international fit there. Put that back on. So it does have a plastic feed. I'm not sure what I'm gonna ink this up with yet. I might do like a brown ink because it's kind of in between that rose gold and red and I think it would just look nice together. I just, I really like this pen. It's so cool, so unusual. And yeah, well, the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna ink this pen up and let's see how she writes. that they uh griffos they have to like check the nibs before they leave because this nib wrote perfectly out of the box i mean yeah that wrote really nice <laughs> actually and you know it actually felt you know the way it wrote it actually felt kind of like a, a gold nib speaking of gold nibs so if you wanted to upgrade this nib to a 18 karat gold nib, they do have that option. It's on their website. You can order that nib and you can have, you know, the stainless steel nib and a gold nib. And let's talk about the price since we're talking about that. So this pen with the stainless steel nib is $275. I actually think that's a good price. So, you know, for a pen that's, you know, it's not like any other pen out there. It's very different. It's got a lot of personality. 
I think, you know, this is a pen that you take out and it's kind of like, whoa, <laughs> that's pretty. So this is something not, not everybody has. And let's say you wanted to upgrade that, that nib to a gold nib. It's only gonna cost you an extra $200. So you can get this pen with the Stingray leather with an 18 karat gold nib for the grand total of $475. It's still under the $500 mark, which I think that's actually really, really good. Under 500 bucks for a really cool, nice writing pen, you know? I, I'm, I, you know, if I end up keeping this pen, I'm definitely going to upgrade to the gold nib just because I, I like my, I like to pimp my pens out, you know, obviously. I like it to be sassy and special and yeah. I mean, who doesn't? Who doesn't want a fancy pen with a fancy nib? Now the pen is only available through Griffos. So you can find them on their website, the Griffos USA website. They also uh, make appearances at pen shows. So if you happen to come across them at a pen show, they do sell their pens there. And this isn't the only really cool, I mean, they actually have an assortment of really cool pens. I'm talking like they have pens with alligator leather on it, ostrich leather, salmon leather. Yeah, I mean, it's like just really cool kind of exotic type of pen. So you have exotic leathers on these pens. And I appreciate that. I think it's really cool. It's something so different. And I know there are other leather wrapped pens out there, but I mean, I have never seen one like this with Stingray leather on it. This is just so interesting to me. And yeah, and I think the price is actually really good. So be sure to check them out. They are also on Instagram. So as, as also their website, their Instagram account, they are, you know, if you send them a message, they are very responsive, which I appreciate. You know, good customer service always makes a big difference when you are buying a pen or if you have any troubles with pens. So just saying. Well, I hope you learned something new about Griffos pens, all made in Italy. Very cool. And be sure to go check them out. Go give them some love on their Instagram account. And thanks for joining me. And that's how the ink flows. Music